So as some of you may know, I'm a huge Back to the Future fan. I've built replicas of the Flux Capacitor and Mr. Fusion and collected many other replica props through the years. Recently I was browsing my mini factory and ran across a model of the Pepsi Perfect bottle used in Back to the Future 2. I thought I had to print this to see how it compares to the other replicas I have. In 2015, Pepsi officially released a limited run of Pepsi Perfect bottles, which is also the year Marty McFly traveled to in Back to the Future 2. I happen to be one of the lucky ones who got one at retail price. Also in 2015, Cinemex, a movie theater chain in Mexico, released their version of the bottle and a slightly different version of it in Argentina. Sadly, I think the official Pepsi release is the worst replica of the bunch. I remember getting some free filament from a company named Faberdashery called Crystal Clear. I had yet to try it, but thought this would be the perfect, no pun intended, print for this filament. The filament does appear to be very clear, but will this result in a clear Pepsi bottle? Guess there's only one way to find out. Let's get to print. Well, I definitely wouldn't call that crystal clear. Unfortunately, after looking at other clear filaments, none of them seem to be truly clear once printed. I decided to finish the print anyways by printing the lid and the flip straw in a blue color I had that closely matched the other replicas in my collection. I then printed a label and applied it to the side of the bottle. The model itself looks fantastic, and I'd like to thank Mischief Company for making it available to everyone. I will keep this bottle in my collection for sure, and I'm currently looking for either a transparent dark brown paint or filament to print out another bottle. Hope you guys enjoyed this short video. Remember to subscribe, like, comment, and share, and I'll see you in the future.